Hey guys, so woke up still with a headache and lots of neck pain. I took my mom to the airport like at 5 in the morning, which let's just say was not fun. And I got back, went to sleep, woke up, slowly started my day, and I'm torn as to what to do today. I've been like organizing and taking some product photos, but you know, I really want to film today, but I don't know. I don't know, because I am going out tonight for my birthday, which is tomorrow. And um, since it's Saturday night, I'm going to celebrate tonight. I don't have a lot of friends in town, so it's going to be a small, small group, but I feel like I need to do something and not just like stay home. This room is a mess. It's a total mess. Since you got chemo yesterday, he's back to be Mr. Finicky. So food stocking him for sure because yesterday when they weighed him, he was 30 something, 30 point something kilos. So I think his max, I think was 32 kilos. So he's lost not a crazy amount of weight, but I don't want him to lose any more weight. So I'm food stocking him. It's crazy how he's losing weight and Luna's gaining. I mean, it's not crazy because obviously chemo affects him, but I'm just going to, um, do my best to fatten him up. I mean, it's not to the point that the vet is concerned. I believe when he first was diagnosed, I think he was 27 kilos. So he was, you know, sick. Right now, I think he's 31. I think I said that. Anywho, I'm torn whether or not to film. I did finish editing my May favorites and I'm uploading it as, I'm gonna put in the title of June favorites so that people actually click on it. But in the video, I say May favorites. And then I like put, May slash June and I'll put something in the description box. I just know if I put May favorites no one's gonna click on it and to be honest most of the stuff in that video are still favorites so maybe until I get to the point where I could do a favorites video every day I mean every month maybe as one of you guys suggested I should just do it every other month and just do like May slash June or whatever I don't know I don't know I know I say this all the time I just I don't know where the time would come from I haven't even been able to be taking my cousin so it's not like I have that to blame it on. It's just, I don't know. I think some of it might have to do with the fact that I hate being in silence. I'm not gonna, you guys are like that. I like having noise. So even when I'm talking to you guys, like it's annoying that there's like no noise. And when I say noise, sometimes music, but most of the time it's like some sort of video on. So Netflix or Hulu or YouTube. And while I say and I feel like it is in the background, I'm sure that there are several points in the day where it's not necessarily in the background, like I'm actually actively listening, which is obviously not allowing me to do other stuff. So I guess one thing I would like to work on is committing to silence, like silent working for block of time a day and see if that helps. I mean, if I'm like in the zone, then I don't hear anything. And honestly, I'll have to rewatch whatever it is I was playing, but I don't know. God, this pimple's finally gone. It's like in the last stages. So I don't know. If I do film today, it's going to be my Gen Beauty haul. So I posted the cocktail party, but I always do the actual haul separate because it's usually so much stuff. This time it wasn't that much. I probably could have put it together, but that way I was able to get that video out by filming it that first day. And then I have to also post the giveaway. And I also have to ship out the giveaway prizes from this past month. I appreciate that no one's been like hounding me about it. I know I said it would go once a month, so technically I'm still in the clear on that. But yeah, I wanted to get in a couple more before I made a trip to the post office. So that's probably gonna happen in the next few days. That's what's going on. I'm about to photograph these Moda brushes from Royal Langnickel because they've reached out to me and they've sent me a bunch of stuff. But I was like, can I get these? Because hello. <laughs> they match my aesthetic. I wish I had one of those Instagrams that were like so on theme and like color coordinated and all that. I just find that's so difficult to do because I want to post product photos of all, a lot of the things that I get but they don't necessarily match the aesthetic so I just do it anyway. Or like obviously pic a picture of Hugo brown with grass in the back was definitely throwing everything off and obviously it wasn't a product photo but it was birthday, so I was not gonna post that. So, I don't know. Still, you know, sticking to the product photo every other photo. Obviously, Tuesday is 4th of July, so I have today and then three more days off. So, I should be able to catch up on a lot of stuff, hopefully. I really do want to film, but I'd have to, like, get a lot in order real quickly to film. Maybe what I'll do is get ready really early for going out and just wear that makeup to go out because my original plan was to put makeup on, film, then by the, by the time I go out, it's gonna be like, uh, so take it off, start over. Speaking of going out, I should probably start drinking a crap ton of water right now. Yeah, we should be doing that. Also, I need to edit yesterday's vlog. Okay. See how quickly you could fall behind in life. Let's do this.
so just took Hugo outside. Homeboy's got diarrhea, so now I gotta rush over to the vet before they close to get that special diet for his belly. Oh, Hugo. Poor Hugo. Okay, just took a little power nap. And I woke up wanting something, I don't know what, so I looked at the ad for Publix and they got pickles by one going free. So we're gonna get some pickles, some pasta. I don't really have a lot of groceries because since my mom was in town, she's kind of been feeding me. So I should probably get something because when I come home tonight, I'm probably gonna be hungry. For sure. So I'm not home eating rice and pickles. I'm on my way to the emergency vet with Hugo. Diarrhea was now bloody, which is changes everything, makes it a lot more serious. And I texted my vet and his oncologist. His oncologist hasn't gone back to me, but my vet was like, "Yeah, you need to go to the ER." So there we go. Like I can't even have one night to celebrate my birthday and to try to be up. <laughs> so he doesn't have a fever. Stick something up your butt. I know what you're thinking. You're like, Mama, I'm fine. I'm fine. Let's go. Let's get out of here.